Some church members are using their sewing machines for a good cause. They're making quilts to give to the elderly as well as people who are ailing. Channel 3's Lori Mitchell has tonight's Making a Difference. I just picked up on this because I wanted to help in the church ministry. At Red Bank Church of Christ, there's a unique ministry that's bringing people together, people of all ages. And how old, old are you, Miss Jane? Okay, so this is going out everywhere, huh? <laughs> what is, 80, 87. <laughs> You don't look it, well, thank you. and you certainly don't act it. Thank you. The ministry is called Threads of Love, started by veteran quilter Mike Goodson. And we're always looking for ways to get cross-generational uh, situations because they don't naturally cross on their own. Now I'm fixing to sew it. <laughs> They're going in parallel paths, and sometimes you have to force those paths to cross. Goodson came up with the idea for a quilting ministry a few years ago. After a church member asked him to help her make a quilt using college t shirts. The group started in a small room with donated sewing machines. Some of the members were skilled quilters and others were beginners, but the group, made up of men and women, quickly became good friends. Me and Miss Jane, we don't sit on the same side of our church, so um, I would have never gotten to meet her and work with her and learn about her life. When they started, they had no idea the scope of what the ministry would do in Chattanooga. They make lap quilts for the elderly and people in wheelchairs. Mental health groups, physical therapy, oncology, and dialysis patients. They also sew blankets for new babies in the church. I've been on the making side of quilt and on the receiving side of getting a quilt, and it's just, it makes you feel wonderful. As many as 50 people have been part of the group over the years in a classroom where friendships are formed over sewing machines. One lady said that uh, she has known these ladies her whole life, but not until she started quilting with them that she actually knew them. And that gave me a clear indication that our program was a great benefit here to our, our, our church congregation. Does she, she cuts it and pieces it and everything? Oh, I just love, love being with everybody. And I love sewing, and it's just sort of a pastime, something to look forward to. Making a difference with a piece of cloth. Lori Mitchell, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.